1.6 is finally out. With it, a boatload of new content has just been released. Originally only going to be a modding support update, there are now a lot of quality of life updates, new items, drinkable mayonnaise, new pets, and mystery boxes. Yup, mystery boxes are now in Stardew Valley, and they kinda suck. We waited this long for 500 megabytes SMH. Yeah, some AAA developers need to take a hint. All right, we're in. <laughs> oh, shit. that's loud. <laughs> Meadowlands farm. It's not the best for growing crops, but there's a chewy blue grass that animals love. You start with two chickens. Okay, hold up. I need to get my character. Okay, farm name Moo Moo Farm. <laughs> Cause it's Moo Moo Meadows. You know what? Let's make the favorite thing Stardew. Let's go with the full tree and Thania. All right, let, let me see. Is there anything? Use legacy randomization. Make random choices in a way that often repeats patterns. Most players should keep this disabled. Oh, I'm so glad that he added that. You know what? Let's do remixed mine rewards. Why not? You know what? No, we're not skipping the intro. Oh yeah, shoot. I forgot to see the change log. I'm probably gonna make this into its own video. We are going to be going back to Stardew Valley. Okay, we're here. We're the Riverland farm, or the, not the Riverland, ew. Okie dokie. <gasps> I was right. I was right. Okay, okay. I was in Gal Pal Cal's chat Where yesterday, is it? <laughs> right? And I was saying, instead of parsnips, you're gonna get hay from the farm thing. I was right, dude. Yo, this farm looks sick. Get two little chicks. Get Pecky and Clucky. All right, Pecky and Clucky, go ahead, do your thing. All right, I didn't actually read the patch notes to see if animation canceling was gone, but actually, can I sell these? Me Oh, interesting. So you can sell the chicks immediately. I didn't think that'd actually be a thing. Anyway, let me turn on my animation canceling and see if it's still a thing. Okay, animation canceling is still a thing, everybody. We got more blue grass over here. So it looks like blue grass is just gonna be like pretty much everywhere on this farm. Oh, dude, updated the map. Oh, and you can actually see this. Nice. This is so cool though, dude. So happy that the update's finally out. So I'm thinking, right? How much are chickens? Cause I could probably just get another two chickens pretty much right away i would think okay they're 800 g so i would have to get a little bit of money before i do that let's just look through the inventory here so we got skills okay we got progression here no clue what all this does but sure we got newcomer all right crafting the text sign is available immediately animals special items and powers here are all the books that the patch notes were talking about collections pretty much the same i gotta say it's really different starting with 15 hay instead of 15 parsnips it's like do i go into town and do i buy parsnips or what do i want to do <gasps> he added more background to the bus stop it fills up the screen there's no black borders anymore dude i just want to like explore because about buying parsnips i just want to go places i want to do things okay cool so looking at this we got the egg festival and the flower dance seems like the bookseller comes in pretty much right before both festivals and then there's also this desert festival that the patch notes were talking about which uh you only gain access to after you unlock the desert getting started if you want to become a farmer you need you have to start with the basics feed your chickens each day by letting them eat grass outside or by placing hay into their trough once they are mature harvest an egg okay so the getting started is different too do i even want yeah, I do want parsnips, actually. I'm gonna buy 10. All right, guys, who should I marry on this farm? I was thinking Abigail, maybe, but we'll see. Maybe I marry Mario. We got two things on the beach, day one. Nice. You got some new ideas to sleep on. Okay. Dude, there's so much stuff added to this update. I've said that like at least five times now. Waterfall. All right, hi, Linus. How's it going? He changed the texture for the sticks. Wait. I just got some carrot seeds. We got some carrots, baby. Hell yeah. Oh, wait. Oh, no. Wait, there's sticks right here. Huh? Oh, so wait, there's... Okay, there's a new kind of sticks that drop the seeds. Okay, and I'm assuming there's different seeds for each season then, I would think. Put some more stuff in here and then let's plant these crops. All right, we got carrots. We got new crops, baby. I'm so excited. Excited to see, you know, who likes what, all these new things. It's a good day to be a Stardew Valley player. And yes, by the way, I'm going to be turning this into a video right after I'm done streaming. That's a tree. <laughs> That's a big old tree. Oh. 
Okay, so there is very obviously going to be a door here. I can't break into it. So there's another tree over here. There's another tree over here. There's so many big trees. Oh yeah, I want to see. Is this area accessible? Okay, it's still only for that, it seems like, but you can see it. Wow, okay, I just got so many spring onions. You love to see this many spring onions day one. Oh, only a master of the five ways may enter. We got, we got new stuff. We got new stuff. Hell yeah. I don't want to grab the blue grass. Like, I don't want to harvest it accidentally. Look at all that wasted potential over there. No, I'm kidding. I'm assuming Grandpa's Shrine is up there somewhere. Anyway, I have some new ideas that my character wants to sleep on. So, uh... Yeah, let's go ahead and do that after I uh, make my farm totem thing available. Okay, there we go. Oh, I just realized my face cam is blocking the... You know what? I'm going to turn my face cam off. Lighting is very nice in here, I must say. Wait, is that text for when you level up a skill? I think it might be. Like, whenever you level up a skill, it tells you, I I learned some new stuff. I might want to sleep on it. Okay, spirits are mildly perturbed today. Who cares? We don't care about Pierre in this playthrough. All we care about is Jojomart. Oh, I should have made it where I could only buy stuff from Jojomart. You know what? I'm adding that right now. I know I just bought stuff from Pierre's, but who cares? Let me add that to the custom command real quick. It's day two. Becky looks really happy today. So wait, can you break these? Whoops. Oopsie. <laughs> my bad kind of cleaning up on the farm right now i don't know exactly what i want to do farm wise because right now those parsnips are mainly for when i'm going to the mines like i'm not going to be selling them they're mainly for food so maybe i want to try and get a bunch of forage to sell because getting forage to sell is fine and then that why that way go to marnie's and grab the stuff I also got to be on the lookout for those special um, crop tillables. I need to come in here. Oh, wait, I can't sell stuff to... Oh, <laughs> there's a Joja furniture catalog. Yo. All right, well, I guess I just got to plunk these into the shipping bin then. Can't quite go to the beach yet because I got too much stuff in my inventory. Hey, Vincent, you want a dandelion? Don't care. All right, let's see if he has any different dialogue. Thank you for the fishing rod, Willy. I want to see the new bop, the new bobber over here. Yeah. Oh, you could randomize it. There's new bobber styles for different kinds of fish. Really excited to see what that's about. My main objective right now is to get enough money to buy another chicken. Just so I can have that going for me. And I'm going to sell a bunch of this because I'm going the Jojo route. And I am not going to be completing any of the bundles. Even though they would greatly benefit me and help me in the short term. Not going to do it. I'm going full in on the jojo route and being a full capitalist where do i want to go fishing first uh, honestly i'm gonna go to the mountain large mouth bass yeah baby first catch so there's a new first catch animation cool i have a command set up for it river jelly a rare jelly found in fresh water it's milk himself <laughs> gives 75 energy 33 health and gives plus 30 max energy for seven minutes so the only way for me to get money through farming is by doing stuff with animals yep i leveled up in fishing okay confirmed you've got some new ideas to sleep on means that you leveled up good to know that will help with speed runs so much specifically the mines 50 speed run you basically are, are just mining to get to the point where you're at mining level level one after you get that message it's gonna be very helpful why did i keep all my tools on me this sucks i'm just gonna keep fishing screw it actually <laughs> i'm gonna slide i'm going to sell most of this fish though as well as that to see how much they sell for oh and it's raining tomorrow so i need to make sure to give my chickens some hay i think also getting a silo very early on into this farm is going to be a very big investment it sells for 125 g that's pretty good it is now day three on the meadowlands farm hello chick <gasps> they're grown up i got two golden eggs robin the local carpenter lives north of town in exchange for raw materials and money she'll construct new buildings on your farm if you build a silo you can start harvesting your own grass all right cool i got two golden eggs right off the bat man let's go that is huge for money i'm gonna sell both of those right away and then i'm going to do the classic day three spring one strat which is i'm going to go fish for the catfish right after i pick up all this forage actually um let me go pick up that largemouth bass that i got yesterday 
right here. And then I'm going to go down to Marnie's. Wait, it's 800 for... Yeah, it's 800 for chickens. Okay, I only need 300 gold more. I'm gonna see if I can get some fish right now and get enough money for the second chicken right now. Unfortunately, I don't think you can sell eggs to Marnie. You can only sell them to Pierre. That's the biggest trade-off in this challenge is that I can't sell stuff to Joja Mart. I can only sell stuff to Pierre. Oh, I'm foraging level two, not fishing. Okay, never mind. Is this enough? It is. Nice. Oh, fish smoker. Place fish inside with a piece of coal to create smoked fish, which is worth a double. The quality of the fish is preserved. Catfish bait? Wait, it's bait though. I need a better fishing rod in order to be able to... Ooh, I got a blue bobber. Nice. Time to go to Marnie's and buy two more chickens. All right, what are we calling this one? You know what? I'm going to name all of my animals after... I'm going to name them all after Mario Kart tracks because it's Moo Moo Meadows Farm, right? So we got Rainbow Road. And then the next one, I think I'm going to do Mushroom Gorge. Mushroom... Gorge. Oh. Let's do Mush Gorge. Now, a big question that I have is I wonder if Concerned Ape changed Shane's marriage room or if it's still the same. There's beer tracks everywhere. <laughs> Anyway, time to go fish for the catfish. Wait, someone wants a special order board. Looking for a herring to roast up for dinner tonight. Okay, I think I actually had a herring at home. Oh yeah, right, this, huh, okay. I'd also love to get a catfish right about now. Thank you. Okay, well. <laughs> Selling Galaxy Sword, pristine condition, $500, nowhere. It's funny going from a high level fishing rod. Oh. That was a catfish? That was the easiest catfish I've ever caught. What the hell? <laughs> I was reading chat because of how easy it was. There he is. So I, you saw my notice that you posted. Okay. Delivery Lewis. Nice. Anyway, I have two catfish, even though I just remembered that it doesn't matter because I'm not going the Jojo route. Any, or I'm going the Jojo route. So guess what? Screw you. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> I need these for money. You know. Yeah. I'm... You can't see my face right now, but I am making a very disgusted facial expression. Man, why am I going the Jojo route? Dude, I got a fire quartz on day three. <laughs> the game knows. The game has to know, right? Oh, you're not going the community center, right? Okay, let me give you all the community center stuff before then. <laughs> Just cancel it and go community center perfection. I've never gone the Jojo route before though. That's a thing. No, it's funny. It's funny as hell. You know, I'll keep going Jojo route. Now, the one thing that Concerned Ape could add, and I would love him forever and ever and ever more than I already do, is he could add a feature to place walkable tiles on water, specifically on your farm, or just make a bridge, exactly, something like that. Oh, I just realized how early game is gonna suck for money. I'm gonna have to, like, fish. <laughs> My carrot is ready. A fast growing colorful tuber that makes for a great snack. Hot damn. That is pretty good. Yeah, carrots go kind of hard. Not gonna lie. That is pretty busted. Be free, chickens. Eat the grass. I gotta say, I really love this, that you start with a coop. Like, I was thinking in my head, right? Like, with this farm specifically, the coop would have a different texture. Like, it would be a little bit run down. And then it would cost slightly more to upgrade it than the other coops. And then it'd just become, like, a normal big coop. I almost have enough wood for the, the bridge over at the ocean, but not quite. Yeah, no. You, you really need to bring your hoe everywhere in 1.6, because there are now two different types of uh, tillable tiles. Let me see if I can find one here. Show it off. Well, I'll show off all these spring onions. Nice. Fisherman. Woohoo. Yeah, it was my first time catching a sardine. <laughs> Dude, there's, I'm, I'm getting so many notifications on my phone that people are going live. I feel like saving up for the fish thingy or whatever it is from Willy is going to go crazy. The fish smoker. It takes a coal and a fish, retains the quality of the fish, and then doubles the value of it. So imagine getting an iridium quality legend, getting the perk that makes it so fish sell for more, and smoking it. How, well, how much does an iridium quality quality legends sell for. All right, so with the angler perk plus 50%, that's 15, that you would get 30,000 G. Dude, wait, imagine there's an enchant that you can put on the iridium fishing pole that makes it so any fish that you fish up are automatically smoked. Dude, what if there is? What if that's a new enchant? Hey, concerned ape, you know, if you need any ideas. <laughs> You just have auto smelting on a fishing rod. Also, in the patch notes, if you read them, if you shut the door behind your chickens, did you guys just see that? It faded instead of just 
shifting. I also feel like it's a lot darker in here. Anyway, if you close that door, your animals are going to be a lot happier. I'm really hoping I have a good luck day tomorrow. Level three fishing. All right, good humor. Nice. Oh, hey, I got, I got Dudley. Let's go, Dudley. Yeah, Dudley. All right, I need to make sure to let my chickens out. Oh, there's a new Jojo letter. Hey, it doesn't look the same as the others. So I don't know if there's anything new in the mines quite yet. Obviously, I'm going to have to check. But yeah, also, apparently weapons dropped from lions and crates and stuff now can have innate en enchantments that are just like applied to them automatically. So that's going to be cool to find. Good point. I probably should have tried to grab the level two backpack today instead. I'm used to doing it with a level one backpack, so I should be fine. I have a lot of spring onions, so I should be good in that department. Now, one thing that I would get rid of my bug meat for is a cherry bomb, which I did get. But I need to remember to not delete stuff for community center items because those just don't help me. You know what I am going to do this save, though? I'm going to keep my rusty sword and I am going to reskin my um iridium sword to it when I finally get to that point. It's probably going to take a while, but it's going to be funny. I'll also try and get like a wooden club and reskin the galaxy hammer to that as well. Okay. Oh, I got a stick. I got me a stick. Yeah. It's so nice not to be speed running. I actually get to go around and collect everything. And even if this was a speed run, it'd be reset either way. Such a bad pace. 6:50 p.m. and I'm just now at 4:14. Ah, the bugs. There's so many bugs. Get them away from my face. Oh shoot, I forgot today was Friday. I probably should have checked the traveling cart. Oh well. I want to go grab these crates though in the middle. Will I be able to make it over there and then make it out? That's the question. Probably not. I'm going to go to the top. Go back to 20. I forgot I had remixed mind rewards. Man, I was so expecting to get the steel small sword that I was like, oh yeah, no, I'll get the steel small sword. I'll go home. I'll have a better weapon. No. I got a glow ring. Well, at least I'll get the upgraded backpack tomorrow. Yeah. Wait, can I? Chat, would that conflict with the rules of my farm of only going Joja? I really don't want it to. But I mean, if it does, then it's like, you know what? I'm going to make the one exception that cat is in my bed. I can buy the backpack upgrades from here. That is the one exception on the save. I am 100 gold off, bruh. Okay, it's fine. Spirits are displeased anyway. I'm not going to the mines. We're going fishing. Well, I'm gonna check out what this quest is. Need a copper bar. Oh, there's a star. I think this means like how difficult the quest is, potentially. There you go. I have enough for the backpack upgrade. Woohoo! I don't think you can buy the backpack upgrade from Jojo Mart. I'll go ahead and go to Pierre's and buy that backpack upgrade, I guess. This and the 10 parsnips I bought accidentally from him at the start are going to be the only things that I buy from Pierre. All right, time to go fishing. Dude, there's currently 76,000 viewers in the Stardew Valley category. That's crazy. That's more than Overwatch. Okay, well, that's that's a given. Stardew has more viewers right now than Apex Legends and Minecraft. There's some bubbles up there. I did not even see those. I think for streams moving forward, I'm going to try and uh, I'm going to need to find a way to record everything without my chat and without this, just so I'm able to edit everything down without all of the backgrounds and overlays and stuff. Damn, these bubbles have been lasting for quite a while. How is it crack a lacking? Stardew is happening? Exactly. Yes, 1.6 is out. There's new stuff. It feels like I'm playing modded, even though I'm playing the base game. Okay, I have a feeling that I am for sure going to get enough money for the next fishing rod just just a sneaking suspicion oh yeah also joja cola it gives plus one speed that's a very nice change they made to it honestly it's not for too long but it just it gets you hyper enough and gets you moving uh sell everything because i'm going the joja route Ooh, okay so level four fishing we have the recycling machine worm bin and deluxe bait Ooh. so we have regular bait which is times five for one bug meat deluxe bait five bait and two moss causes fish to bite even faster increases size of the fishing bar for now though i'm going to put all my tools away i don't know why i put them away in there and i am going to go to the mines because it is a good luck day all right i missed the coal floor on floor 12 so i need to go grab that real quick Good to know. Go. Come on, club. Or force sword. That was.
was like the worst crates that I've ever gotten. Nope. Wait, actually, I got kip carrots from them. Not the worst crates that I've gotten. I got a set of crates that literally gave me basically nothing. They didn't even give me crates or uh, kip carrots. I need to go grab the coal from this floor because I'm not speed running. It doesn't matter if I go down the ladder immediately. Oh my gosh, there are so many bugs. Go. All right, for a sword or a wood club or both. Either or, don't care. I would just like something, please, game. Or neither. <sighs> I'm so sad. I think, actually, for the rest of the day, I am going to try to unlock the Adventurer's Guild and then see when I can get the insect sword, the insect head, because that got buffed, actually. I think it didn't get a change. I think it just got buffed, but hey, a good sword is a good sword, you know? Also, the fact that I got a double glow ring and I'm at these floors, it feels so nice to be able to actually see. <laughs> I deal so much damage. Gonna die eventually, guys. There it go. Oh! I got a jacket. Pretty cool looking jacket too. It's a bit short, but I mean, that's literally in the name. All right, time to floor reset for slime kills. One thing for sure though, is that I am planning on getting basic sprinklers. Why you may ask? Milk. I don't plan on having that many crops. So that's what I was trying to say. All right, I completely forgot what I need to kill for the insect head. So I'm going to leave the mines and go check. Uh, ooh, decorative sword. That's cool. 40 out of 80 cave insects. I think it's cave insects that I need to kill. Let me just double check real quick. Yep, that is how you get it. Craft two more furnaces. Get the full five furnace combo, baby. All right, however, I am going to be right back. All right, we're back. Hey, I got two more carrots. Let's go. Another earth crystal. Wow. Wait, what? Oh, there's two little ore nodes here on the table. Love how my first instinct was to try and break them. That's a cool little addition though. Hey, two new rewards. Nice. So we got cauliflower and melon seeds. Also go over to the beach. Do I want the deluxe fishing pole? Because I could also just save up for strawberries. Yeah, you know what? I'm just going to save up for strawberries. I'm going to grab the deluxe fishing pole later. And instead, I'm going to go ahead and grab enough wood so I can expand the bridge in the beach. I almost just pickaxe one of my cauliflowers. That was not good. Next sign. You can write a custom message on this sign. Can I place it on fences? I can't. Okay. That's cool. You walk close to it and nice. I wasted wood on that, but hey, I wanted to see how it worked. To put my cookies away in here. And then honestly, I don't know why I'm keeping these. I should just sell them. Except clams. I want to keep clams. I don't know if I need to complete the rat problem quest line in order to do the Joja Mart, but I'm going to go read the scroll either way. Ooh, what we got this time? Oh, oh, I get a price ticket off of that. Oh, I don't have a cave carrot though. Damn. Okay, it's two days. I should be able to get that. All right, fixing the bridge. We got it, baby. Well, that was worth it, I think. But what am I going to do next? I'm going to go look for that cave carrot because I want that price ticket. I have decided... <clears throat> I have decided that I want to marry Maru. Okay. Hey, there's my cave carrot. And I got the one clay that I needed for the silo. Oh no, I need 10 clay. Okay, never mind. I always forget that. Anyway, time to go give a cave carrot to Gus. All right, we get to see what the prize ticket machine does. No, do not see. Here's what I owe ya. So I get the 75G and a prize ticket. Bring this to the prize machine in Lewis's house for a special reward. Oh, oh boy, we get a new cutscene. Ah, hello there, Tree and Thania. I was just loading some more prizes into this machine here. It's a new program I've come up with to help promote a spirit of goodwill among the townsfolk, you included. It's pretty simple. Sometimes when you help others in, pra in town, you receive a prize ticket. You can turn them in for rewards. There's some special stuff in there. My only worry is that people will just go after the tickets rather than cultivating a true compassion for their fellow man. Uh... Yep, I'm in it for the prizes. <laughs> I see. That's not what I hope to hear, but I appreciate the honesty. <laughs> At any rate, keep checking the help wanted board in town. Uh, that's a good way to get your hands on more tickets. Good luck out there. All right. Cool. I got 12 carrot seeds. <gasps> it's the mystery box. Those are the mystery boxes. How did I get a ticket? Um, so you get tickets from helping people from doing the help wanted quests so like these up here i think after a while you'll get like if you do them in a row you'll get more and more tickets either that or it's like depending on the person or something but i got 12 carrot seeds from it so hey 
12 carrot seeds, and I'm going to put quality fertilizer on them. These carrots are going to be really good energy. Spirits feel neutral today. All right, I might go mining today, question mark. Oh, there's no water thing here. Oh, how far away do I have to go to get water? Okay, so I, I can come up here. Is there anywhere closer? So if you plant your crops right here and you wanted to go water. Okay, so that's not, yeah, no, that's not happening. Although I think just coming over here and grabbing the water over there is better. But if I'm being, if we're being realistic, I think just moving your crops over better. So that's good to know for future. So the coop start, I mean, it's okay. I feel it's not like anything to be super excited about. I don't know. I feel like the coop start is still pretty cool. Also, the fact that carrots only take three days to grow is insane, especially for 75 energy. Like if you get that prize ticket immediately, that is crazy good. Here's to hoping that I can get a good weapon. Thank you. <gasps> yes! I threw away the rusty sword. You know what? You know what? I don't care. I don't care. I got the wood club. That's all I care about. Ooh. Oh, I just realized. Wait. Oh, it has one of those innate upgrades. It just has plus one speed. That's cool. Even though I'm using animation canceling, but hey. But hey, I finally got a good weapon. It was bound to happen eventually. All right, time to go to bed. Hey, level three forging. Cookout kit. Let's go cookout kit. And moss soup. I don't know what moss soup is, but I leveled up four skills. All right, let's see what moss soup is. It's a cooking recipe. All right, fair enough. All right, I have a couple things that I would like to do today. I'm gonna go use my hoe in the mines to try and get some cave carrots and some clay for the silo because i'd like to get the silo as soon as possible oh hey it shows you what floor you've made it to the mines like the lowest that you've gotten that's cool other than that i think i'm gonna go fishing again today i'm just gonna go and i'm going to find a floor with a bunch of tillable spots in it quite a while longer as long as oh hey i knew it i knew it was one of these floors okay I'm going crazy. I got six clay off of that. I'm good now. That was all the clay I needed. And I also got nine cave carrots. Wow. Okay. So in the amount of energy that it took me to till all those spots. Wait, potatoes sell for 80G now? Oh, wait, I forgot all the other stuff that I need for the silo. <laughs> Whoops. I was like, oh yeah, I just need the stone. So I got the 10 clay, 100 stone, and then I need uh, five copper. And I'm gonna go do that right now. And then I'll go over to Clint's and grab all the stuff over there. It's pretty cool. Put the silo back here. Actually, silo fits right here pretty well. I'm just gonna set it there. Ah. Fishing time. Oh boy, I sure you love fishing. Got a house plant from a slime. Nice. I just realized there's probably some fish in the ocean that I should go over and see if I can fish up. Also, I'm happy Bombay is a cat in the game now. Oh yeah, I saw the thing where there's new breeds. There's also a turtle pet. I don't know if that's only a pet that's accessible after you get your first pet all the way to five hearts. I don't know, I'll have to check that. I didn't really cycle through the pets. I just wanted, I wanted Dudley. And also after today, I think I have been on my computer since probably 9.30 this morning. And it's currently 5.23 and my eyes are, I look at the time sometimes and I can't see what it says. I'd love to keep playing and keep streaming, but I unfortunately I need to end stream after today. I need to go take a rest. I will do the bookseller next stream. Thank you all so much for stopping out to the stream. I am going to have a bunch more stuff ready for tomorrow, and I'm going to get rested for tomorrow as well. Do it all again. You want to see my reaction to bookseller? I'm going to be turning all of these VODs into videos, so then I'm also going to be uploading the VODs into my alt channel so people can watch them. I'll talk to you all later. Bye-bye.